Hey everyone, welcome back Crown Geek here. So today in this video, I will be sharing three different ways to check your drive on Windows 10 and Windows 11, which can be your hard drive, SSD or any kind of USB drive. Now knowing these three methods are really important as they will help you to track your drive health and even for any further troubleshooting. So without any further delay, let's quickly get started. And the very first method will be using the built-in smart feature. And smart is basically the self-monitoring analysis and reporting technology. And it's a built-in feature on most modern drive that can monitor the disk attribute and alert the user in case a drive is about to fail. And this is the reason why I'm recommending you to do a drive test. And many other people also recommend this because if you find that your drive is going to fail, then you can do a prompt backup salvage your data while you still can and replace the drive manually so in order to check with this method you will have to click on your windows search type cmd right click on the command prompt click run as admin click on yes the black window of the command prompt will appear up and here you have to type a simple command that will be wm ic space disk drive you need to type exactly and even I will leave this in the description. Space get model comma status and hit the enter key. And within few seconds, it will show you the status in a very clear manner. And on the left hand side, it says model and on the right hand side, it says the status. So it shows me all my disks connected to this device. On very top, it shows my USB that is SanDisk. And the status shows me OK. Next one is the generic storage device USB device. And that also shows me OK. Third one is the Seagate hard drive. And it says OK. And the last one is my SSD, the main primary uh, disk on my computer. And it shows me OK. So with this quick command, you can at least know the current status of your hard drive, your SSD or any kind of USB drive. But in case if you need a detailed information that what is the percentage of drive like uh, is it OK? Is it about to die? So in order to get the more detail, now you have to go with the another method. So this was the first one. If you want to only check the status, you can check it. And now next you can use your manufacturer tool like there are many tools specifically created for your drive and your hard drive manufacturer like Seagate. WD, ADATA, Samsung most likely has a drive monitoring utility that can be downloaded when you need to check your drive health. So ADATA has their own SSD toolbox, Seagate has their own C tool and WD has their own digital dashboard that you can download. I will leave all these links in the description. Even the Samsung has their own tool here. So whichever manufacturer you're using, uh, you can download their tool. Now, in case if you are not sure that which manufacturer SSD or hard drive you are using uh, for that, click on your Windows search, type here system, click on system information from the suggestion. And here from the left hand side, you will have to click on components. Then you have to look for the storage, click on disk. And here in the disk only, you will find all the information of the drive connected to your computer. All right. So on my end, you can see I have a hard disk here by the name Seagate. That is an external hard disk media. It shows you all the detail here. Then I have the ADATA SX8100 NP. That is the fixed hard disk. And that is my SSD, the primary SSD for which I want to check the health. So now what I can do, once I know the manufacturer name, I can come to their official website. I can download the tool here. Once downloaded, uh, it will be downloaded in a zip file. You can extract the file, run the tool, and it will come up with their own dashboard, which can be different for the ADATA, for the WD, for the Samsung, for the Seagate. So on my end, it's ADATA. Now you can see it's giving you the detailed information. Like in the previous method, we only got to know the status that was OK. But here you can check the entire information that the drive health is good. The temperature is this right now. The remaining lifetime is 84%. So that's good. Excellent. 
and so on. It also display me another hard disk by the Seagate. However, it's not showing me the remaining lifetime and the temperature here, but drive health shows me good. Okay. Now, part of showing you the hell, this tool gives you many additional options that you must check out, like the diagnostic scan, where you can run a quick scan or a full diagnostic scan, and it will be diagnose your SSD or a hard drive to find out if there is any kind of problem. And probably, accordingly, it will suggest you some kind of suggestions. Then you have the utility section where you can firmware update, uh, you can toolbox upgrade, or there are many other options like security arrays, very useful feature again. And it says security arrays permanently clears all the data on the selected SSD, so the data cannot be recovered. The function cannot run on the boot drive. Now in case if you have a USB or any kind of SSD or external hard drive, not the one that is your boot drive, and if you want that the, all the data should be permanently deleted so that nobody can recover it, then you can use this tool in order to complete the steps. Very useful tool that you get within the A-Data SSD toolbox. And I believe so on another toolbox also you will be getting these options. Next you have the system optimization uh, where you can optimize it and you can choose the level is standard or advanced. System information, it gives you all the detailed information here. The benchmark, you can go in and do a benchmark here. Clone drive option, another useful feature. If you want to clone your drive to any other SSD or a hard disk, then you can do that for absolutely free using this feature only. All right, so this was the second method, guys. Now in the third method, you have to use a third party tool and that will be applicable for all kind of your drive or for your SSD. And one of the popular tool for this is the Crystal Disk Info. I will also leave the link in the description. You can come here, download the tool. And once you download it, you may get the similar dashboard here like on my end. And on the home page only, uh, it shows you all the information like what kind of SSD you are using, what is the capacity, the firmware detail, the serial number, the drive letter, the feature enable, and what is the health status and it shows me it's good 84 percent the temperature is this below you'll find all kind of other detail that you can check out so that's really amazing and not only this on the right of it you will find a small arrow and if you click on it it will show you the status of your other drive connected to on this computer so this one is my seagate uh, hard drive and it says health status caution reallocated sector count 32 now once i know that i have a problem with my hard drive and i know that i have some important data inside it so now of course i should move on and take the data backup to any other drive or in the cloud storage wherever i want to because i got a caution here i got some indication that this hard disk or ssd can get corrupted anytime it can fail anytime or it can be dead anytime so this is the advantage of like checking the status of your hard drive or your SSD. All right. So these are the three best ways, guys, that you can use in order to check your drive status and to troubleshoot many kind of problem. And that's all, guys, for today. Hopefully you found this information useful. If yes, make sure that you hit the like, subscribe, and I see you in the next video. Bye bye.